Greetings friend. Watch refrigeration news for Friday, January 12, 2024 on our channel. Atmosphere APAC Summit 2024. The 43rd MCE, the designation of Poland as a partner country with great potential for the HVAC plus R sector. Carrier expands made in India HVAC product portfolio. Starfrost offers cost comparison service to support switch from costly cryogenic freezing. Hussman launches Evolve Technologies. New Bitzer ammonia system dramatically reduces energy use and carbon at Pilgrim UK. Johnson Controls creates new possibilities in residential decarbonization. Dear friend, please like this video if it was useful for you. First news today. Atmosphere APAC Summit 2024. The 10th Atmosphere Annual International Conference on Natural Refrigerants, held in Japan, will be a two-day event. Atmosphere APAC Summit's mission is to highlight the existence of the latest natural refrigerant technologies for various applications, both environmentally friendly and profitable for the commercial and industrial refrigeration and air conditioning industries. Read more the news on our website today. Second news today. The 43rd MCE, the designation of Poland as a partner country with great potential for the HVAC plus R sector. On Tuesday, January 16, 2024, at the Italian Embassy in Warsaw, Poland, a meeting dedicated to the 43rd MCE Mostra Convenio Expo Comfort, the leading event in civil and industrial plants, indoor climate, and renewable energies. The Italian ambassador to Poland, H. E. Luca Franchetti Pardo, will host the event at his headquarters on the occasion of the official presentation of Poland as a partner country of the 2024 edition, scheduled in Milan from 12 to 15 March. Read more the news on our website today. Third news today. Carrier expands made in India HVAC product portfolio. Carrier has expanded its HVAC products made in India with a range of air handling units, AHUs, and fan coil units, FCUs. These units are crafted to meet the diverse needs of India's commercial buildings, providing custom solutions for healthy indoor environments with high-efficiency air filtering needs. The expansion from products such as air-cooled and water-cooled chillers, variable refrigerant flow, VRF, systems, packaged light commercial units and cassette and high-wall split-system air conditioners to FCUs and AHUs affirms more than a five-decade manufacturing presence in India. Read more the news on our website today. Fourth news today. Starfrost offers cost comparison service to support switch from costly cryogenic freezing. Starfrost, specialists in cooling equipment and solutions, now offer an energy comparison service to assist frozen and chilled food manufacturers in managing the ongoing rise in gas costs. This tool helps food processors assess the shift from expensive cryogenic to more affordable mechanical freezing, typically yielding a one to two year return on investment. Read more the news on our website today. Fifth news today. Hussman launches Evolve Technologies. Hussman, a Panasonic company, is proud to announce the launch of Evolve Technologies as part of its ongoing commitment to providing low global warming potential, GWP, refrigeration solutions. Hussman is one of the world's leading manufacturers of refrigerated merchandisers and refrigeration systems, producing, installing and servicing refrigeration solutions that display and preserve fresh foods in more than 250,000 supermarkets and convenience stores in the United States. Read more the news on our website today. Sixth news today. New Bitzer ammonia system dramatically reduces energy use and carbon at Pilgrim UK. Demeva Refrigeration Limited has installed a high-efficiency, state-of-the-art Bitzer ammonia refrigeration system at Pilgrim UK's meat processing facility at Bromborough, Wirral, dramatically reducing the company's energy costs and carbon emissions. Energy costs for the previous cooling system were £146,000 a year, compared with an estimated £61,000 for the new Bitzer ACP pack, saving over £80,000 a year in running costs, a reduction of nearly 60%, and delivering substantial savings in carbon emissions. Read more the news on our website today. Seventh news today. Johnson Controls creates new possibilities in residential decarbonization. Johnson Controls announced the completion of the U.S. Department of Energy, DOE, Cold Climate Heat Pump Technology Challenge Laboratory Testing Phase. 
Johnson Controls exceeded the performance benchmarks at extremely cold temperatures and achieved heating seasonal performance efficiencies well above today's baseline products. Read more the news on our website today. That's all. Share the news with your friends. Follow Refrigeration News on social networks. Please find the links below.